besides being rappers who have achieved worldwide success. They are also wealthy men who are very fond of showing off the material possessions they have managed to achieve during their lives. But have you ever stopped to wonder about what these celebrities' residences are like? In this video, you will get to know all about the most luxurious mansions of hip-hop stars. Before we get started, I challenge you. You have to click on subscribe and activate notifications check the option all. But you have to do that in less than 5 seconds, you got it? And if you can, write in the comments hashtag all about subscribe. Alright, let's get started. Snoop Dogg As his success and also his fortune increased, Snoop Dogg acquired a new and more modern mansion in the city of Diamond Bar, California. The house is inside the coveted gated community country estates, a residential community full of luxurious properties. This is an excellent option for celebrities who want more privacy, but don't want to give up their proximity to Los Angeles. Boasting a total area of an impressive 25,800 square feet, the home boasts 7,000 square feet of living space, spread over six spacious bedrooms, including the master suite located on the ground floor and six bathrooms. The property's decor is quite old. After all, she was built in 1977, having a strong presence of solid wood furniture, besides having a yellowish lighting, which brings the feeling of greater coziness to rooms. The property also features a wood-paneled office, a game room with a pool table, and an excellent outdoor area with a large pool for Snoop to cool off in the hottest days, a hot tub to relax in, a barbecue area, and a court that serves for the singer to play tennis and also basketball. The rapper acquired this property in 1998, paying $720,000 at the time. Currently, his residence is valued on real estate websites at over $4 million. Rick Ross Of course, a man as powerful as Rick Ross invests in extremely luxurious properties. An example of this is the rapper's 54,000-square-foot palace, located on a massive 235-acre plot of land in the town of Riverdale, Georgia. Nicknamed the Promised Land, the residence is certainly a material asset that Rick Ross is very proud of, as he doesn't skimp out on the posts on his social networks showing details of this mansion. Being always surrounded by numerous luxury cars, the facade of the house resembles a real palace of a lucky king. Decorative statues of Greek gods make the entrance of the residence even more exquisite. In addition, the initials of Rick Ross' name can be found everywhere, giving the mansion even more personality. Throughout his large plot of land there are several ways for the rapper to have fun. He has, for example, a paddock for breeding strong horses and giving them have plenty of room to live a golf course to have fun with friends, a giant, comfortable movie theater, some artificial lakes that beautify and refresh the property, a giant pool considered the largest residential pool in the entire United States, with an impressive 350,000 gallons of water. It is also known that the property has a total of 109 rooms, and that they are extremely exquisite, with gold details in the chandeliers, walls, and beams. One room that draws a lot of attention is the entrance hall with two giant circular staircases and a very high ceiling that offers great amplitude to the place. And to take care of all this infrastructure, the rapper certainly has to cash out a pretty penny. Just to cut the grass and keep the lights on, he said he used to spend about $1 million a year. But if you think that the property only provides expenses for Rick Ross' pocket, you are mistaken. It was once used as a set in the Eddie Murphy movie, coming to America, serving as the Palace of Zamundan. And to rent it on that occasion, Ross says he pocketed $2,750,000. From the scenes shot inside the mansion, you can get an idea of how exquisite it is. Featuring 12 bedrooms in total, the master suite is a room of luxury. Not to mention the bathroom, which has a giant hot tub right in the center. In addition, the rapper has already given interviews in his house, showing a little more of the interior decoration. And it is possible to note that he loves paintings and works of art. This property belonged to former boxer Evander Holyfield, until in 2014, Rick Ross bought the estate for a great price, paying at the time $5,800,000. But after the rapper made purchases of neighboring land and made major renovations to the residence, surely it must be worth much more today. Ice Cube 
Ice Cube is one of the most successful American rappers who loves to invest his fortune in luxurious real estate. One property that the rapper acquired was a modern-style mansion located near a canal in Marina del Rey, California, which is used as a vacation retreat for the singer's family. The three-story mansion is over 7,500 square feet in size, offering diverse accommodations for Ice Cube to live in with plenty of sophistication. To access the upper floors, there is an elevator and an elegant glass staircase, and among the main rooms are a classic-style living room and an office with wooden walls, which has several bookshelves with books and decorative items, and a dining room with two sophisticated chandeliers and a cyan table next to sliding glass doors. In all, there are 11 bathrooms in the mansion, one of which is more compact and another one that has a fireplace and spa tub while the kitchen has wood cabinets and a glass countertop with adjustable seating, and another living area next door. The mansion also has six rooms of distinctive design, which provide much comfort to the residents. In the case of the suite, there are glass doors leading to a balcony with enchanting views of the region, as well as a private bathroom and a dressing table for the singer's wife. There is also a well-stocked wine cellar, which features wine barrels, a music room with a piano, a bar with an attractive chandelier in the center, and other living rooms with some fireplaces for family use on a daily basis. A distinguishing feature of the mansion is the large home theater, which features custom seating, a high-end projection system, and glass doors leading out to a balcony. Outside, the mansion located near the canal has stunning views available to the star and his family. There are also trees on the well-cared-for lawn, some more private places to relax, a terrace for outdoor leisure activities, and a shaded patio on the top level that has an outdoor fireplace and plenty of space for entertaining friends and family. This incredible property belonged to actor Jean-Claude Van Damme, who bought it in 2012 for $6 million until he sold it to Ice Cube for $7,250,000. When it comes to choosing a good place to live with his son, Wiz Khalifa doesn't skimp a bit. In 2022, Wiz Khalifa decided to buy a new mansion in Encino, in the city of Los Angeles. Already at the entrance, one can get the idea of how luxurious the property is, with impressive and cozy rooms, which prove that the property is worth every penny. The property is no less than 8,000 square feet and sits on a half-acre plot of land. The mansion, which is a farmhouse, has classic style and several items in shades of cream and brown. The kitchen is covered in wood, with a style reminiscent of the countryside. Most of the furniture, including the cabinets, are in cream tones, mixed with black furniture and windows and white walls. While going to the second floor, it is possible to appreciate the beautiful stairs of the property, with them being always bathed in light. The master bedroom has a classic decor, as seen in other rooms of the house. This suite's bathroom is super luxurious, even having a view of the outside. The closet is huge and done completely in light tones. The house has other rooms for visitors, with them all having in-suite bathrooms. The outdoor area is surrounded by greenery and has a modern and charming swimming pool, which is one of the highlights of the property. In addition, there is a basketball court, barbecue area, and a guest house. The guest house, where Wiz's guests can stay, has a kitchen, bathroom, and even a small cinema. There is also an en-suite bedroom, in the same modern style as the house. In addition, it even features a small gym and massage space. And according to some sources, for Wiz Khalifa to enjoy all this luxury, he had to fork out a whopping $7,600,000 in 2022. Lil Wayne the great rapper Lil Wayne is quite fond of having waterfront properties to enjoy a lot of comfort in. He has bought a new property located on Allison Island in Miami, a safe and sophisticated village filled with mansions. This is a contemporary residence full of straight lines and wooden coverings that contrast with the white walls and the vegetation of the gardens, managing to strike a good impression straight from its facade. The main entrance door gives access to a luxurious living room with double height ceiling and sea views, composing a beautiful natural look. The furniture in brown tones provides a refined aesthetic without losing its coziness. The 10,600 square foot home offers much comfort for the resident, having the living and dining rooms integrated together to the outdoor area. The chef's kitchen is minimalist, with cabinets built into the large wooden panel. The central island is connected to a table that serves both for quick breakfasts and for meals for up to six people. 
Next door there is a very relaxing area with a beautiful vertical garden that provides an enhanced sense of well-being. Throughout the rooms there are giant glass openings that integrate outdoor and indoor life, as well as offering plenty of natural light and a refreshing sea breeze. The house features a total of seven well-ventilated and clean-looking bedrooms, with the master suite being the highlight. It is surrounded by glass walls that can easily be covered by built-in curtains. And, of course, Lil Wayne's bedroom features a large balcony with ocean views, a spacious walk-in closet and a beautiful lavatory with a relaxing bathtub. Not to mention the other 10 bathrooms with great finishes scattered around the mansion. Other amenities from the residence are a movie room with a great sound and picture system, and a spacious office. But undoubtedly the most striking feature of the property is the outdoor area filled with relaxing armchairs and surrounded by green grass. The refreshing infinity pool offers panoramic ocean views. And, of course, there's a barbecue area in order to prepare meals al fresco. Lil Wayne acquired this property in 2018 after paying $16,700,000 at the time. Currently, many real estate portals estimate that the value of the mansion is approximately $30 million. The rapper has really made a profitable investment. Travis Scott Scott is a hugely successful rapper who likes to invest in properties that resemble a real luxury resort. Travis Scott's most famous and exquisite property is in the quiet Brentwood neighborhood of Los Angeles, California. There is an impressive 53,000 square feet of space distributed in its rooms with high-quality interior design. And for Travis to accommodate his guests, there are a whopping seven bedrooms in the house, with the master suite being almost the size of a regular apartment, with a sitting area, super spacious bathroom, and a walk-in closet for the rapper to accommodate his looks. But, without a doubt, the most striking feature of the mansion is the outdoor area, especially the 72-foot-long infinity pool lined with glass tiles. And to acquire this luxurious property, Travis Scott paid $23,500,000 in 2020, but currently some sources estimate that the property is already worth $36 million. Diddy Diddy is one of the most successful rappers of this age, with him being a fan of buying and selling impressive mansions. The most valuable property the star owns in California is his main mansion, with it being built as a European-style villa in the Holmby Hills neighborhood. In a video for Vogue's 73 Questions, Sean Combs showed off some of the luxurious rooms in his cleanly designed mansion, which is 17,000 square feet in size. The open layout venue integrates a bar, which on the day of the recording had a professional waiter to prepare drinks and serve them to the singer. Another place Diddy showed off in the video was a more private living space, which features a classical piano nearby, as well as a table with awards and trophies the rapper has won over the years of his career. The rapper's mansion even has other impressive amenities, as it was built under specifications by developer Niall Niami. There is, for example, a beautiful hall at the entrance, as well as several living rooms which, at the time of the records, had a more classical and formal style, but which seemed to have been redecorated when the rapper bought it. The place also has a game room and a wine cellar for drinks, next to a green wall kitchen, as well as having 11 luxurious bathrooms, a library with wooden bookshelves, and eight cozy suites. Outside, the mansion's lot is 1.3 acres, featuring wooded gardens, a casual dining area, a tennis practice court, and a resort-style pool that features an underwater tunnel. According to media reports, Diddy bought this mansion in 2014, shelling out a whopping $39 million for it. Dr. Dre Dr. Dre doesn't skimp when it comes to investing his money in places to live in. One of the most impressive properties the singer owns is in the Brentwood neighborhood, one of the most in-demand neighborhoods in the city of Los Angeles. This is an 18,000-plus square foot mansion located on a four-acre lot, with it having its design inspired by a French chateau. The amenities at this natural retreat include a well-equipped fitness center, a beautiful artificial waterfall and an infinity-edge pool that offers exclusive ocean views, as well as beautiful lawns and solar panels to generate sustainable energy. Upon acquiring this property, Dr. Dre made some renovations, the biggest being to build a supposed 10,000-square-foot underground studio. 
and before the singer bought this property, it belonged to Tom Brady and his then-wife Giselle Bündchen, who had bought the land to build the mansion in 2008 for $11,750,000, until they resold the place to Dr. Dre in 2014 for a whopping $40 million. Kanye West Kanye West was once considered one of the richest rappers in the world, with a billion-dollar net worth. And with such wealth, he has had some luxurious homes. Perhaps his most exquisite home is where he lived before his divorce from Kim Kardashian is in Hidden Hills, California. The property resembles a real palace that was designed following the Belgian minimalist architectural line, having plenty of large and clean-looking spaces. However, by the entrance hall it is possible to observe the concept that the influencer wanted to make this residence give off, causing an illusionist effect by having ceiling, walls and floors of the same color. The furniture is usually quite basic and simple, and this is exactly what makes the mansion eccentric and unique. The master bedroom is also giant and clean-looking, being integrated with a nice bathroom, an environment that has a large glass window that displays an incredible landscaping, permitting the entry of color and light to this space. Something that draws attention in the bathroom is the countertop without the traditional sink tub, having only a hole to drain the water. Quite peculiar, isn't it? Kanye West's closet has several racks with his clothes on display, which makes it easy to choose attires and to get ready faster. One of the rooms of the mansion has a piano and a fireplace to warm oneself up in the colder days. And the dining room would be no different, with everything being very white. The kitchen is one of the only rooms that stands out a little from the others, with wooden cabinets giving more warmth to the environment. But there is also another more secluded and practical kitchen in the residence, where his team of chefs and helpers usually prepare meals. At the time it was purchased, Kim Kardashian and Kanye West paid around $20 million, but with all the renovations and changes, the mansion is now valued at $60 million. Jay-Z Currently, Jay-Z lives in one of the most expensive mansions in Los Angeles, California, being located in the upscale neighborhood of Bel Air. The property, which has never been fully open to the public, sits on a 193,750-square-foot lot and has eight bedrooms, 11 bathrooms, and a movie theater with the best equipment. The residence's architecture is very modern and sophisticated, with an imposing spiral staircase in the middle of the living room. The outside area of the house also has four swimming pools, a basketball court, and a garage space that can fit up to 15 cars. And in 2017, the couple made a surprising real estate transaction, paying on the property the princely sum of $88 million. Drake Having already achieved such levels of wealth, Drake can quietly invest a lot of money in his well-being. One of the luxuries of his life is his mansion located in the Canadian metropolis of Toronto, his hometown, in a noble neighborhood full of big houses. It is a true palace with 49,500 square feet of area, being built in the classic historical style with touches of the contemporary, meeting all of Drake's requests, who wish to have a mansion made in premium materials. From the entrance hall you can see how luxurious the mansion really is, with the bronze and marble chandeliers. Another environment that draws the attention of anyone who enters the house is the suspended staircase, which also has impactful custom-made chandeliers that in addition to illuminating, also reflect on the various mirrors that are on the walls and serve as decoration. Everywhere you look, you can see cladding in solid limestone and black marble with white veins, some very exclusive and expensive stones. To give you an idea of the house's grandiosity, the main room has an impressive 40 feet of ceiling height, a place that has as a highlight the custom grand piano made for the singer and also the chandelier with more than 20,000 pieces of Swarovski crystal. Every detail contains overwhelming luxury, such as the suite's bathroom which has a dressing table and a sculpted marble bathtub that cost the singer £4,000, or $5,300. But not only that, all the other bathrooms and washrooms in the mansion are all clad in marble. The kitchen, as could not be different from the rest of the house, is very well decorated. It features a giant Payanazzo marble island and a dining table next to it for meals with family and friends. However, one of Drake's favorite corners in his residence is his 300-square-foot master suite. He also has a very luxurious walk-in closet, which looks more like a designer store, where he keeps his vast collections of sneakers, jewelry, and basketball jerseys. 
One of the singer's demands was the construction of an indoor basketball court of NBA regulation size. It was beautifully decorated and crowned by a pyramid skylight in the ceiling, as well as having a big screen and a digital scoreboard. What is even more surprising is that the designer responsible for the house, Ferris Rafali, even put a VIP room overlooking the court, the perfect place for Drake to watch the basketball games. The leisure environments do not stop there. There is a dark swimming pool inside the residence, which can provide many relaxing moments. In order to complete the design, there are LED lights in the colors pink and blue. There is also an entire bar inside the house with a vibrant color palette, where the artist can gather his friends and throw good parties. And as it could not be missing from the artist's home, there is a very creative recording studio there, featuring a backlit stone paneled room with a starlit ceiling. Not to mention that he has a room just to store and display on shelves all of his various awards. And some sources claim that this incredible mansion built by Drake is currently worth around $100 million. Definitely, there is no one who would say that they refuse to live in such a palace. And if you believe there are other actors with more luxurious mansions, please tell us down below in the comments. And don't forget to also tell us which mansion you found the most luxurious. Hey, you like the video? So don't forget about leave your like and comment, and tell some suggestions of another videos, and hopefully we gonna do it. All about channel, deals to satisfy your curiosity.